In the vicinity of Kielce during search operations, another extremely valuable wreck was discovered, the superstructure of the German combat vehicle SDKFZ 251 by 9 Stummel. This variant of the well-known SDKFZ 251 armored personnel carrier was adapted to serve as an assault gun. Equipped with a 75mm KWK-37 cannon, primarily used to support infantry and fight against lightly armored targets. The discovery of this vehicle in the Kielce region marks another step in bringing historical military vehicles from World War II back to life. The SDKFZ 251 by 9 version, also known as the Stummel, was introduced into Wehrmacht service in 1942. This vehicle, like the standard SDKFZ 250, was used for transporting infantry. But in the SDKFZ 251 by 9 variant, instead of the standard armament, MG 34 machine gun, a 75mm KWK 37 gun was mounted, which allowed for more effective engagement of enemy positions. This modification enabled the Stummel to support German units in more advanced combat operations, especially during fighting on both the eastern and western fronts. After the vehicle's superstructure was excavated, a team of researchers and military vehicle specialists began a thorough analysis. Although the wreck of the Stummel had sustained some damage due to prolonged immersion in the soil, it still contained valuable structural elements that could be used in its restoration. Experts report, that the vehicle is one of the few surviving examples of this type, making it a rare find. The Stummel variant, SDKFZ 251 by 9, had a length of 5.5 meters, a width of 2.1 meters, and a height of 1.9 meters, with a weight of about 7.4 tons. The vehicle was powered by a 90 horsepower gasoline engine, allowing it to reach speeds of up to 40 kilometers per hour. Its armor, up to 14.5 mm thick, protected the crew from small arms fire and shrapnel. Additionally, the vehicle was capable of overcoming terrain obstacles, making it highly versatile on the battlefield. Currently, the superstructure of the SDKFZ 251 by 9 Stummel is another vehicle set to undergo a comprehensive restoration by specialists from the KIS Association. The restoration efforts aim to return the vehicle to a condition suitable for exhibition in a museum or for educational and display purposes. Upon completion, the Stummel will become a valuable part of the museum's collection and a symbol of German military technology during World War II. If you want more, let me know in the comments, subscribe, and leave a like. Thank you.